Hey YouTube, Dubop711 here. This is part three of how to treat green hair algae um, and basically any other algae that's susceptible to hydrogen peroxide. And in my previous two videos, I kind of went over the science behind it, dosing options, um, along with some other stuff. So you might want to check out those videos. I'll put a link in the description. Um, this is my 40 gallon breeder. And so right here is where my test area is going to be, right next to this Anubis. So that's it right there. That's the green hair algae. Um, and you can see a bunch. It's just a bunch kind of like right in this area. And so I'm going to be taking my spray bottle. I'm going to go ahead and spray the affected area. So I'm going to go ahead and fully submerse it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, now if you saw my previous video, we measured out how much hydrogen peroxide is going to be acceptable in uh, this treatment method. We didn't want to use too much because it can harm your fish and plant, so you, you do want to be careful. Um, so I'm going to keep this video short. I just wanted to show you all the method of how it kind of works. I've got some more over here on this Anubis right here that's on the driftwood. But that was my treatment spot. It generally takes about anywhere from 30 seconds to 2 minutes. And then you're going to see a lot of bubbles start to form in a... I'll be showing that in the next video. I don't want to make y'all wait for two minutes to just watch bubbles. Uh, but I'll talk about some other stuff in my next video. This was part three of how to treat green hair algae. Look for part four coming up shortly. And uh, as always, rate, comment, and subscribe. Drop, leave me a comment if you have uh, any information on how to treat green hair algae or any improvements I can make. And I'll see y'all here in a little bit.